In my recent detailed video about Centromedic continuous wheel balancers, I talked about what is pretty much a standard set depending on your bolt pattern, the 300-318 set. And I talked about the A and B balancers. Now this is a set of Bs and you can see how much clearance it has on the backside of the balancer and the outside of the caliper. Now, if this was uh, an A set, it would be really close. It actually would be too close. There wouldn't be uh, enough space here, and that's why I run a shim if I was gonna run an A balancer on the front of this Dodge Ram pickup. But the B balancer with the bump out that you could see right there on the face, no problem. So this is that same B balancer pulled off of the wheel studs and it's laid in the wheel, which is off of the truck, obviously. And this is another critical fit test. You've got to ensure that the balancer fits on the mounting surface and it's not hitting anywhere on the backside. On the wheel, you know, it's got to clear the brakes on one side, but on the other side, it's got to clear the wheel. And sometimes it looks like it clears, but it really doesn't. And my other example in my longer video was the forged aluminum power wagon wheels and why I could not run these same B, B balancers in the front. I needed to run A balancers with a little shim for the best fit.